Hello and welcome to our unboxing video. Uh, we're going to treat ourselves with a FS700, Sony SF700. Um, we bought it from Preston Media and we thought we'd uh, show you what's inside the box. Now I've got you know, a bit of a kind of camera on my head situation going on so we can give a good th first person view of an unboxing video just for fun really. So let's have a look. We've got, I've, I've got Matt on the sidelines. He's not being, he's not on camera, he's just being shy over there, because he can. So, we get a carrier bag, black carrier bag, that comes free with the price. Uh, I don't think that was an extra charge. And we got a cardboard box. Yay! Uh, so we start off with a plug, always a good start. You know, you need a plug. Uh, let's open this up. Right. Bit of foam, always good. Yeah, need a bit of foam. Uh, what we've got here. I don't know what this is. Looks like the view. View, the viewfinder thing. What we can look through. Very good, that looks all nice. Um, yeah, everything's all neatly and inconveniently bubble wrapped for me. We've got a microphone that comes with it for the onboard mic, I'm guessing. Uh, another viewer, I think I'll tidy all this up in a sec. Instructions, which nobody uses. Uh, we'll see what's in here. Uh, okay, let's start off with, which I think is the lens. Let's see what this is like. Uh, now this lens is, looks like a missile, 18 by 200 millimeter lens. Uh, it does look like a spacecraft. Um, <laughs> I'm quite scared to touch it, but usually lenses are pretty durable. So, lovely. I'm saving the best to last, you see. You know, the beast. For all your charging needs. What else do we have? Alright. Got the, uh, the... I never know the official names of these things. But it's the little remote control on the side. And what else do we have? The power brick, I'm thinking. Yep, power brick. Standard power brick stuff. Dun, 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 dun. Lots and bits and bobs in here. It's gonna take a while to put all this together, I think. Little bracket for the top of the camera. Uh, remote. Because because why not? Uh, we'll put that aside. Plenty of wires that usually just end up in a wire bucket. Uh, we've got a little battery, an NPF770 battery. Catchy name, not too bad. The reason why we chose this camera was because of the slow-mo, the 240 frames uh, a second, and it really kind of wanted us, we saw some clips of it being used and we just really wanted it. Here it is. And, wow. There you go. It is, it feels a lot bigger. It looks a lot bigger and it feels sturdier than I thought it would do. All right, so I don't know if you can see that, Tom. Tom on the camera, by the way. Ledge. Uh, okay, so it's a lot heavier than I thought it would be. Very sturdy. We've got the uh, LED screen here. Very nice, flips up. Um, feels really strong. All the buttons feel nice. Everything else feels, it feels like the amount you paid for it. Um, yeah, I just imagined it to be smaller. I don't know why. But yeah, there it is, FS700 with the lens and the charging and the remote. Uh, the viewfinder, microphone that comes with it, some stuff, some more stuff, wires, remote. We do have another box that came with it. This is just for the compact card. Our assistant, Matt, will show us just a compact card. Amazon, again, a, bit, a little bit ridiculous with their boxes. Only kidding, folks. All right, so we'll open that up now. Yeah, so... Um, you know, just in case, you never know. 
Uh, first thing we get is, I think this might be the rain cover. We have to pay additional for this. Yes, it's a Comray, Comrade rain cover for the SF700. Looks very durable. Uh, doesn't feel cheap. Um, and it gives you all the kind of access to the remote on the side and everything. So that should fit nicely. Um, looks pretty cool. We have uh, another microphone. This microphone is not a Rode microphone. This one looks slightly bigger. Um, so that one could be used for more interviews. This is more of an onboard mic just for just getting that ambient noise, things like that. Just This is just a box full of prizes. Uh, it's wicked, but we're not giving it away. So uh, some SD cards, we were just saying we need some more SD cards. Uh, and we got two 32 gig uh, SD. These are very good quality, actually. I know the higher the number with the circle in it, the better, the quicker the data transfer and all that stuff. And this is 10. Uh, we've got a, like a bracket thing for uh, the road mic. So I need to go into detail with that. Oh, this is interesting. We've got some cotton buds for your ears, just in case you get a bit bored. Uh, no, it's obviously some kind of cleaning, five piece camera cleaning set that came with it. So that's quite useful. We haven't really got any cleaning sets as of yet. So that's, well, there we go. Um, it's got like some kind of brush. It's like a little bit of a makeup kit. Um, oh, this looks familiar. Not one of these. Okay, so we have got, I didn't know this was coming with the kit. Before, I'm actually using one right now, um, but it's a Sennheiser. Uh, Sennheiser radio mic. So if I'm using my hands like I am now and you want a clip on mic and it's all goes on the back like that and it goes to a recording device over there. Um, and that comes with the kit as well. <laughs> we got another one of these, so yeah. I know what this is. You should know. It's a boom pole um, for recording audio. I won't get it all out because it's a bit of a faff, but you know, it's what you see people holding the poles with the microphones attached to them. So that comes there. Very good. Wind jammer for your microphone, so the wind doesn't get picked up. Uh, an LED light, we're actually using one of those right now, but this is a little bit bigger, I think, than the ones that we got now. A uh, bit of a different brand as well. Usually comes with different filters, takes different batteries. I recommend these for just on the spot, getting a bit of light on someone's face if you're doing an interview, perfect stuff for that. And that comes with a kit as well, so that's brilliant. Uh, XLR cable, just, just for fun really, why not, chuck it in. Uh, so another cable, running out of space. That comes with it as well, brilliant. What else we got? Uh, battery, I just think they threw in a battery, for fun. So an additional battery for the camera. Uh, right, what's this? A bag. I always harp on about bags. My biggest thing is bags. If you, you get good bags for your stuff, tripod then you, yeah, it's a tripod bag, but it's, it, it's important to get good bags because you're going to carry all this stuff a lot. There's going to be a lot of carry, a lot of moving it around between rooms and different interviews. So if you've got good bags, it makes the whole job easier. Uh, that's a tripod handle. So I bet it. But uh, yeah, we got a few of those. Yeah, we got three of those. I'm going to keep all the tripod stuff together. Um, more wrapping. Whoa, got something big here. And this is the bag for the camera. So let's take a closer look at this. Right, so this looked like a pretty cool bag. I don't know, let's check out the pockets. Can you see that, Tom? Um, nice uh, orange interior so you can see all your wires, usually a lot of black wires so you can see all the stuff, all your stuff in there, doesn't get lost, so if you're in a dark room and you're searching for your bag, yellow interior or orange interior is ideal for 
finding all your stuff. Really sturdy bag. Lots of cardboard in there. And inside, we've got quite a bit of stuff. I don't know what this is. This looks cool. <laughs> when you're stressed out, you can throw it at somebody. And that just sticks. Yeah, it's a divider or maybe like a cushion, just for making sure that nothing gets broken. Uh, strap for the bag, looks like a pretty good strap. I don't think that's gonna be snapping off anytime soon. Yeah, it's only got two pockets on the side, but that's all right, plenty of room for everything you need. I think that's a pretty good bag. Get it, it's a bag. I'm getting heckled. <laughs> so if, he, if he's heckling, why doesn't he come on and show you the stuff like I am? Right, more cables, more cables, XLR cables, blah, blah, blah. Headphones, that's pretty cool. We've got some uh, Sennheiser powerful sound experienced headphones, pretty good. And then, rawr, last but not least, we got another tripod. So we'll get this out. H22 TV tripod. Um, Probably not as durable as kind of the tripods we're using, but I think it's a pretty good one. Uh, it's got a balance switch. Um, should, I don't know. It's a bit of a, I haven't come across these ones before. So we'll have to see how it goes on the field. But it looks pretty good, uh, pretty sturdy. I'm sure it's gonna, it's gonna hold the weight of this. So, and it came with the kit, so all good. So that is everything that we got in, I think it's everything, isn't it, Matt? Yeah, that box is empty. Um, so we got we bought the Air, the FS seven hundred with the kit, and that includes, as you can see, quite a lot of stuff: um, headphones, radio mic, all useful stuff. I would recommend it. I think it's pretty good. A lot, a lot of value there. Um, and that's it. So if you like the video, if you are interested in kind of what the FS 700 can do. I think soon we're going to be going out and trying to get some cool things in slow mo, give it a bit of a test. So maybe we'll upload that soon. And yeah, just let us know what you think and we'll be happy to reply with any uh, questions you've got. So that's it. That's the unboxing video for the FS 700. Uh, thanks to Preston Media uh, for being very helpful over the phone and dealing with the inquiries. And that's us. So thank you for watching.